how's it going YouTube uh, this video is about how to get Skype on your Thunderbolt uh, this is just a walkthrough uh, I'll show you what it looks like Skype mobile and uh, I don't have anybody in my contacts because I just did this but I have two accounts set up so I can uh, I'll call my desktop and show you how it works. And I've actually Skyped with one other person, uh, just this random person, uh, just to see what the quality was like, and it's really good. Uh, I don't know if you've used Tango, but it's way better than that. Okay, anyways. So I'll put the link in my dis in the description, but uh, basically you'll go to this link, or you can just Google HTC Thunderbolt Skype, and it's this one under news that says Skype with video chat leaks on HTC Thunderbolt. Click on it. Okay, and then you're going to go down, and I'll have the exact link in my description. Click here to download. Okay, and then it'll take you to Mega Upload. It's just a download site, and you got to wait 40 seconds uh, to download it. So while we're doing that, I'll show you. Um, it works great. Um, and this isn't the official release yet in the app market. Obviously, that's why we're doing this, but uh, it makes me really, really excited because uh, this phone was obviously supposed to come with Skype. All right. I'm, uh, I'm taking this from my old Palm Pre phone, so the camera's not great, and I apologize about that. Two, one, zero. Regular download. Gonna download down here. It's only about eight megabytes, eight point nine, I guess. All right, that's downloaded. Okay, exit out of there. Come on. Very crappy computer. Sorry about that. Okay, it downloads. Here's the file. It is comes up as com .skype, whatever. It doesn't matter. All right. So then you're gonna want to hook up your com your phone to your computer and put it from charge only to disk drive, so that your computer can recognize it. I'll pop up here in a second. And uh, you know, open file, and then I just put it down here. Just put it right in your SD card. Okay. Then that's all you have to do for that. And you can go back to charge only. Okay. Give it a second for the SD card to prepare. Okay. And then, I've already got it installed, but I'll show you. You know what? I'll remove it so that you guys can just see exactly. Um, all right. So, menu, remove app. Sorry, you can fast forward this part if you'd like. I'm not going to edit this. Uninstall it. Just in case you don't know how to do this, how, how to install an app from online. Okay. Then you're going to want to go to your market and download something called Astro File Manager. It should pop up. You can't see it, but that's what it is. And it's just a way to manage your applications. Okay. I've already got it downloaded. So then you'll go to Astro, oops, Astro, okay, and you'll go to your SD card, oops, and it should just be in there, right there, com.skype video, okay, and click on it, and click the bottom one, which says open app manager, and then you click install, okay, 
and then now it just kind of looks like you're installing an app from the market. Hit install, take a minute or two. While it's doing that, I'll pull up Skype on my computer so I can show you just how it works. Uh, I created another account so that I could do this just for this purpose. All right, and then you're gonna have to, if you don't have something set up, then you're gonna have to do it. Uh, hold on a second. You don't need to see my information. All right, sign in, accept, accept, signing in. All right, continue, continue, finish. And uh, it's asking you um, about syncing contacts. And for right now, I'm just going to say don't sync because it will take a while. All right, now I'm all logged in here. All right. Alright, now I'm all logged in here. Okay, now let's do a call. There's me, Howard Boyer. Uh, that's on from my phone. So if I click call. No, it's calling on here. I'm gonna hit I can do audio, video, or decline. So I'll do video. And uh, take a second. settings and uh, there we go that's me taking the video I don't know how to set the best way to show this but uh, oh, I turned my brightness all the way down so you can't really see it on here but it just shows my face on my phone because I don't have a webcam ho hooked up to this computer this is just for demonstration purposes but as you can see it's not choppy uh, it's not laggy it's not all pixelated it's pretty cool and uh, if you have a Thunderbolt I highly re recommend uh, downloading it and also when you're not using Skype uh, I recommend uh, I'll show you when you're done using Skype this is kind of important uh, go to my info uh, it's up at the top here can't see that probably and then Right here it says online. Make sure that you sign out. And otherwise, Skype's just going to keep running and it does drain your battery pretty good uh, if you have Skype on all the time. Um, but, anyways, that's how to download it. It's really easy. I'll have the link in my description of this video and hopefully it works well for all of you. Alright, take care.